With a mask mandate now in place at Bay State Health due to a rise in COVID cases locally, we wondered what the largest school district in Western Mass is doing to prepare. So tonight we spoke with Chief Communications Officer for Springfield Public Schools, Azel Kavan. She tells Western Mass News they're not seeing the increase in COVID-19 yet, but they are ready just in case. Normally what we see in the community, it tends to mimic itself in our schools. Now that the holiday season has come to an end, as El Kavan of Springfield Public Schools tells Western Mass News they're advising students and staff to take proper hygiene protocols to avoid spreading germs, especially COVID-19. That includes washing hands often and masking up if they feel sick. Right now we realize it is so confusing because COVID is the only illness that has that requirement. So we are reminding families and students and staff that if you do have any of those symptoms um, and you find out it's not COVID, that you should still stay home. And even though they're not seeing a rise in cases just yet, Kavan cautions that Tuesday was just the first day back after winter break. So it wouldn't be a surprise if they did see a spike in the coming weeks which is why Springfield schools already follow CDC guidelines with hand washing. Buildings also have dedicated sanitation stations. And while masking isn't mandated, masks are available in schools by request and encouraged for those who have pre-existing conditions. COVID-19 has been with us for several years now, so it's sort of common language and common protocols. So we just want folks to really abide by those guidelines. If student or staff test positive, they must stay home and isolate for five days. If they have no further symptoms after that, they can return to school but must mask up through day 10.